Hi, this is Professor Wolber from AppInver.org. In the first two parts of this Paint Pot app, I've kind of shown you how to draw circles here and you know change the color by clicking these buttons. Okay. In the next step, I'm going to show you how to draw lines and then also show you how to kind of how to clear clear the canvas of whatever drawings you've done. Okay. So first of all, let's 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 think about lines. Let me kind of hide the simulator for a second. And I'm going to make some room on my canvas. I'm going to click on these event handlers and if you click uh, control click at least with your uh, Mac you can say collapse block and I'm just going to do that for all these guys and that'll kind of get them kind of out of the way so we can build some new stuff okay so there's there's these blocks um, kind of out of the way we can always uncollapse them and and take a look okay so I'm going to draw lines or let the user draw lines I'm going to grab the dragged event okay and it's a little more complicated than the touched event it's got six, seven parameters, right? Start X is when the user touches down for the first time and starts dragging, that's the first place they touch down. Then every time they move just a little bit, previous and current are the locations of kind of the line segment between where they were and where they are. Okay, so we're typically going to, we want to draw our lines between previous and current. And really what you got to realize is this dragged event gets gets triggered a bunch of times as the user drags their finger across the screen. It looks like they're drawing a continuous thing, but it's really a bunch of little lines. Okay? So for a canvas.dragged event, what we want to do is call canvas.drawline. Okay, and we used draw circle before. I'm going to pull in the draw line. Okay. And what we're going to want to do is we're going to draw a line from the previous place to the current place. Okay? And with App Inventor 2, the way you grab properties, or sorry, grab event parameters, is you go to this variable section and grab these get blocks. Okay? And in fact, what I'm going to do is x1 is going to be previous x. I'm going to go ahead and copy this guy. Okay? I'm going to copy it two more times, so I got four of these guys. Um, and what I'm going to want to do is go from previous x, previous y. That's where I want the line to start and then I want to end it up with current X and current Y. Okay, so as the user drags their finger, this event will get triggered a bunch of times and each time we'll draw a, a you know, tiny little line from where they were previously to where they where they are now. Let's just test that in our emulator. Okay, let's see. Okay, you notice it's a continuous line but really you got to think of this as a bunch of little line segments getting getting drawn. But now we can draw on our canvas which is which is what we were trying to do okay so that's the dragged event and drawing lines so now the next thing let's do is make it so we can clear the whole canvas and this is actually pretty easy but I'm going to go down to the clear button and when the user clicks it we're going to want to clear the canvas so I'm going to go back to the canvas component okay and I'm going to come down and there's actually a clear block and this just says you know leave the background color but get rid of everything else Okay, so I'm going to go back to the emulator. Um, I like to test as I go. Okay, I think every time we kind of bring the emulator back up, it's going to kind of clear the screen. So let's draw some stuff here. Okay, and now when we click the clear button, it should clear everything we just did. And there it goes. Okay, so now we can draw circles, we can draw lines, we can clear the canvas. Um, the next step is going to be, um, let's make it so we can change the the circles we draw to small and big. Okay, right now they're 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 all essentially of size five. We're gonna make it so we can change to, to different sizes.